guys, it's Carrie from the Williams Post here with my husband Wade. First time on his vlog, it's like the vlog debut. <laughs> um, for the anniversary link up for this, um, for the girl behind the blog, this is, I've done it since it started. Uh, we're talking about whatever we want to, what's on our hearts. So I thought I'd bring Wade in because I've been away from him for a month while I was keeping my nephew in Florida. So I really missed him, and uh, I'm sure he's super excited to be a part of this. <laughs> so, uh, anyways, um, I put questions, or I asked on Twitter and Instagram and Facebook if anybody had any questions, and um, nobody really did except for Chelsea. So thanks, Chelsea, uh, for giving us some ideas. Uh, I guess maybe I'm just an open book. That's what I'm going to assume. So her question, the first one, was what excites us and scares us the most? about our upcoming move to Mexico. If you don't know, we're moving there this summer to live as full-time missionaries, so it's pretty exciting. Um, I'm going to let Wade start off answering that question. Yeah, so hey guys, um, I guess when I would say what excites me the most about our upcoming move to Mexico, um, I really just think about um, letting go of things and taking a big step. Um, you know, it seems like my life's been full of a lot of, of small steps for God, and, um, and, it's, and the Bible's very clear um, about what our lives should look like. Um, so this year we both turned 30 this year and um, it, I, I just think about when Jesus turned 30 he really started you know revving up his ministry and and uh, so here we go you know I'm excited about taking a, a giant step of faith um, you know if God doesn't show up then we're gonna be flat on our butt and, <laughs> and, and, and I'm fine with that I mean um, I, I want this to be about God nothing about us and and so we're just going to take a step, and I'm excited about that step. Um, and at the same time, the, the opposite part of that question was, you know, what are we nervous about? And, um, you know, because I'm still human and, and, and the flesh still, you know, overrides me a lot of times, I still get nervous about um, being able to provide for us when I'm over there. Um, you know, I have the most perfect job here. I love my job. Um, and I'm just going to have to walk away from that and, and try to find something down there, which may not be easy because it's a totally different culture. Um, and I'm just not sure how I'm going to fit into that picture. Uh, but then again, there's an exciting part to that because I get to see what God does and I get to watch Him show out. Yeah. Um, I'm excited for a lot of the same things he said. Um, more, I guess, directly. I'm really excited to just spend time with these people that I love so much in Mexico. Wade and I met there many moons ago, it feels like, and we go back there all the time, and I'm just excited for, like, the day-to-day -day things, like the kids from the, down the canal coming to my house for, um, you know, to color or to eat cookies or whatever, you know, and just have them around. I think about Christmas and having them help me make handmade ornaments and decorate the Christmas tree, stuff like that. I'm just so excited to live life with these people that I already feel like are family and experience that. What scares me, I don't really know, um, I don't know, I guess just like having no idea what's coming next, I'm such a planner, so it's just nerve wracking to have no clue what's coming next, um, but I feel like, especially because of Wade and his example in my life, I feel like I'm not as scared of that as I probably would have been five years ago, so I'm just excited to see where it goes, and I'm so excited that you guys get to be on that journey with us through the vlog. So the next question is like a really serious question. This is really getting deep down in the gut here. And the question is, whose eyebrows look better after being waxed? <laughs> and if you don't know the backstory, Wade went to a new barber because we just moved to a different town. And um, while he was sitting there, they just like, without warning, without asking, started waxing and playing his eyebrows, which I think was dramatic. Oh, it was horrifying. <laughs> Absolutely horrifying. So, um, so then I was like, well, I can't be outdone by Wade. I've never had mine done, so I did my own last week, and I Instagrammed it. So that's where that question comes from. But I'd say Wade's like better. I think his was probably more of a drastic change. Mine, I mean, I already tweeted, so it wasn't really that big of a difference. But uh, that was a fun question, Chelsea. So it made me <laughs> laugh when I saw it. Um, anyways, if you haven't linked up with the girl behind the blog, do so. Just make a video. I know it's kind of awkward, but it's really fun to hear everyone's voices and see what they have to say. So everybody say thanks to Wade for joining. I'm sure he totally loved it. Uh, extremely nervous. <laughs> so, all right. Bye, guys. <laughs>